Why is he doing that? He's dead. He's just spinning around. And we're back, boys, with some more Power World. Yeah, boy. And we're at our new base, which is just thriving at the minute. Look at all our dudes doing work, having a good time. Oh, it looks so much better. It looks so much better than where we were before. It's just cleaner. There's more space. Everyone's having a good time. Look at this guy just chilling in the water. He loves it. So... What we're going to do today is we're going to do a, a quick boss fight. Um, wrong button. I want to go down, kill this dude, uh, King Packer, level 23. Uh, we did kill or did defeat and capture, actually. Catrus, um, who's a level 23. This is also level 23, but this is one that spawns on the open world, overworld. want to get that, and then what we're going to do is explore this little blacked out area just here and see what's going on. But before we do that, I keep getting comments about returning to the first place we spawned because apparently down here somewhere is some lore and i mean we've been keeping up with the lore like we've been reading all the notes and trying to figure out what's going on if there's any kind of story as to why we're here so i think to start we'll go and see what that's all about so i've got spheres i've got cold resistant armor i've got bread we've got eggs oh also do you want to see something amazing if i put all my food here see the timers we've got 24 18 minutes if i press sort it resets your timers. I don't know if you guys know about that. I'm going to guess it's a bug. Do with that what you want. But you can reset your timers on your food. And it's um, it's amazing. <laughs> I think you can even do it in here. Uh, let's see. Yep. There we go. None of that food's going to spoil now. So, you know, when you do... I think you need cakes for breeding. I believe you need, like, loads of ingredients for that. You can keep resetting it and make loads of cakes. There you go. A little tip for the day. All right. Let's go to the start area and let's see what we've got going on. So I think you've got said we need to go back down to the beach, maybe. Literally like where we started is what I've been told. Can you come here so I can ride you? Thank you very much, Wolf. Because, we, yeah, when we start, uh, you literally start here and you walk out. I'm guessing not many people head back down. The best not be some law down here, because that there is. That's so dumb. Why would you put that there? Who's really gonna come back down here? Alright. Let's grab it. Yeah, that's the day one of one. Uh, okay, uh, where is it? Journals. Cool. Alright, here we are then. So Castaway Journal, day one one. I found a strange device on the shore. It appears to be some kind of electrical contraption, but its odd design looks like no modern technology I've ever seen. The device is capable of recording images and displaying information about what is shown in them. I've decided to take photographs of the island using this device and use them along with this journal to document what I find. Okay, is there anything else down here? whilst we're here also as we are knocking about down here if you do enjoy today's episode make sure you are whacking a like make sure you're subscribing you ring the bell there'll be notifications if you want to support the channel that little bit more you can become a channel member or a patron you get an exclusive video every single friday uh there is an egg up there i don't actually need any damn eggs it's like just shit all down here bro is that a giant's chair it's like a chair a giant would sit on am i gonna come down here and find more lore i best not so I'm going to be real mad because that is bad level design. Oh, God. Hello, sir. Is there going to be any... Um... Oh, there's a dungeon. Any lift monk effigy things? So I do need to start collecting them. Interest. Oh, there is one. <laughs> I knew it. I, I, I just knew it. All right. Well, I mean, is it bad level design that you missed the first bit of lore? Yes. I think they should have placed that where you start, but I guess it is what it is. What level is this dungeon going to be? Level 13. Do I want to run to the end on that? Do I really care? What blueprint do we have? Are we going to find anything better than that? It could be some armor. You know what? I'm going to run through, and we're just going to go to the end. We should be able to kill the boss pretty easily. Don't want to waste too many of my arrows, because we've got to take on King Packer. All right, let's just fly through this. And if this is the waterway, then the boss is to the right. Yes. If this is a Tiefen boss, we will be capturing it, though. If it's not, then we're just going to defeat it. Unless it's some Spicer. And we have a Gumos. Right, I, I've been told. So when I was hunting my Tiefen alphas, I got told that you have to, like, leave the cave in order for that boss to respawn. But then someone said you just have to kind of leave that room. I mean, like, they respawned in different... Let me see. I think if you just get out of render. So it was a Gumos. 
Is it going to be something different now? Oh, it, it... Oh! Tombat. Okay, we're capturing this guy. All right. Uh, you know what? You go away. I'm going to fight this on my own. Hell yeah, boys. What is this guy? He looks crazy. He looks like um, Tom from Tom and Jerry, if he was a bat. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, God. So I was looking at my Pokeballs then. I have I got my shield? Oh, this dude's fire. All right. Uh, maybe one more hit. Okay. Let's see. So these are decent Pokeballs. Don't know if I want to be wasting these on this guy, but maybe I do. So yeah, if you just want to keep recycling... Oh, we got a pacifist, but he's really weak. If you want to keep recycling the boss or the alpha dude at the end, there you go. Literally just leave the room and come back. Oh, I wish I knew that earlier. That would have saved me so much time. All right, let's quickly read... Uh, Tomcat. Tombat. Yo, that dude looks cool, man. Um, when activated, it uses ultrasonic waves to detect the location of nearby pals. Okay. So description, often appears out of the blue to flaunt its prized wings in front of other pals. Although this appears to be an intimidation tactic, the pal seems to derive some kind of pleasure from the display. Oh, he just likes showing off his wings. Yo, that dude's cool. Okay, so Catrus and him, like the last two that we've caught, have actually been fire designs. Alright, so we did get a crossbow blueprint, but not what we're looking for. Alright, cool. Well, that was worth coming down here. So all of you that commented telling me to go down there, worth it. We've got a effigy, we've got a law, and we also got a new dude. Alright, what we're going to do, we're going to head back up. We're going to go and take on King Akapaka or whatever his name is. Alright, this dude's in a little bit of a weird area. There's no, like, teleport that's really close to him. There's one in the red forest, and then there's this one. And I feel like he's up on a ledge, right? He's, like, down there. So we had to kind of go, like, up and around to get to him. Oh, uh, we are coming to an enemy camp. What have we got inside of that? What is that? Is any oh, God, there's the enemies. Oh, I, I don't think we've caught whatever's in there. Sniped. Oh, it's like a little genie thing. Okay. Well, uh, this is what I love about this game. You have a, a plan. And... Just, you know, everything just changes. <laughs> right, I got him, Wolf. Don't, don't worry. You just stand there. Like, I wasn't expecting to do a dungeon. I wasn't expecting to get whatever this is. It's like a little emo genie kid. Dazzy. Oh. There's something new. That literally sounds like a cat. That's funny. The Dazzy. Oh, it's electric. Lady of Lightning. While in team ap uh, appears near the player... Following up the player attacks with lightning bolts. Bro, we could have this and daydream out. Oh my god, that'd be amazing. <laughs> um, often kind to lonely pals. However, the moment a pal mistakes this for an actual companionship, it seizes the opportunity to blast them with a thunderbolt. <laughs> so, as long as you stay in the friend zone, you're all good. <laughs> Don't... No, you, no one's getting out of the friend zone. You're in there forever. That's funny. I like that. Um, all right, Mr. Wolf. Are you stuck there or are you good? Uh, you know what? Come here. Nice. Okay, so... I believe... Yeah, just down here. I hear you all, like, gonna shoot at me, but... Yeah, screw you guys. I'm out. Alright, so King Pack. There he is. Level 23. Um, he has some little llamas with him. Okay. Didn't mean to do that. I'm actually gonna get my Catrice out for this. Oh, oh. There's boss... There's, um... Not bosses. What are these called? Fugs. Do I have to take care of them first? Are they going to attack the boss? No, let's just do it. All right, Mr. Giant Llama Dude. God, he looks crazy looking. Uh, yep. She's in the head. Nice bit of fire. God, he's a big boy. Oh. oh. Okay. Don't be flattened. Oh, yeah. His, his minions are joining in. Okay, Catrice is doing good. Not much damage being done to him. Oh, it's on fire as well. Okay. Jesus, I saw that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wow. 
Yeah, this thing's mad looking. I don't like, like me personally, I don't like how chunky he is. Uh, okay, they're not fighters anymore. Like, he seems like, I don't know, is he a balloon? He seems very bouncy. Uh, I feel like my shots are going through him as well. All right, we could try and capture this, but maybe I don't this one time. We've already caught two dudes today. Why do I feel like we are being shot at, at times? Catrus, are you good? Catrus is not doing good. Why are we all standing still? Oh, God, watch out. I'll take care of these. You keep fighting that. Nice. All right. I reload. Yeah, Catrus is doing all right. Nice. All right, there's the minions gone. Okay, I jumped into that. Amazing. Oh, he's like smoked. His face is smoke here. Nope. Okay, nearly dead. One more shot. Cool, missed. Catrus is all you, bro. Missed anyway. All right. Hey! Oh, God! Rolling down the hill. All right, what do we get from you? Just some ancient stuffs. Nice. All right. So, another boss down. Flying through these. Look at this guy. Oh, he's spinning. Oh, Catrus, no, you stopped him spinning. Oh, no, he's still going. Why is he doing that? He's dead. He's just spinning around. Look how long my crossbow is as well. <laughs> and his size doesn't matter, but damn. What's he doing? Oh, God. He was like picking speed up then. Oh, God, he's going to touch me. So, I'm going to guess that's something you can create from these llamas. I know you can like breed creatures into them. God, that, that, that dude's cool. All right, cool. So um, I think that's all the low-level bosses we've seen, right? Uh, what were you? 31. I think level 30 is our next boss that we've seen anyway. All right, cool. So we should be able to follow this path uh, down here, and it's going to take us into the area we've not explored. So we're looking for... I mean, new creatures, new eggs, new bosses, um, lift monk effigies, lore, all that good stuff. Uncovering parts of the map. Maybe we can find more merchants. Uh, okay, it's so not been up this way. This looks like a boss place for sure. Oh, lore. I saw some lore and there's also a cave, which might have a little boss in. Remember we went into a cave and there was the bee? Abandoned mine shaft. Okay, you stay there. All right. More law, more law. Uh, what was that one? Castaway Journal, day 18? Oh, that's all the way down here. Oh, we've missed a bunch. Uh, Castaway Journal, day 18. I decided to distance myself from the tower and have begun to explore other areas. There are places in each area that appear to be vast caverns. They appear to have traces of human involvement and ore can be found throughout them. Could someone have used pals to dig those holes? I can't help but feel overwhelmed by all the mysteries I'm unable to solve. But my pals have come with me no matter where I go. As long as I have food to give them, that is. Bro, it sounds like my cat. <laughs> okay. Let's bring you back just in case. Uh, it's going to be really dark in here. Okay, let's get some fire. Alright, so the last one of these had the B boss. Black Marketer. Um. Right. Oh my god, okay. Are you friendly? Ooh. If I, you know, put fire on that, would that explode? Oh my god, look at his face. Uh, wow, that's creeper. Can we come up here? Don't climb on it. It's not a toy. Hmm. I don't trust this guy. Just saying. Use that bench. No. He's got ammo and stuff. Um, Alright, sir. What are you saying? Uh, I trade in any kind of power. Whether it's stolen powers or even prohib prohibited types. Take a look. Buy contraband. Oh, God. Why is it going to catch us? Oh. Look at that guy. A Nox. They have the weird dragon guy. Oh, I nearly had enough for him as well. So these are like stolen pals. Oh, I can sell them to him. I ain't selling my dudes to you. I wonder if he gives you more money. Let me have a look. Um, 
if I was to sell 170, 187, 628, a thousand for a shiner. Actually, that's only 121. Interesting. Um, what is this? What is that torture device? I recognize all the others. I don't recognize that one. All right, sir. I'm gonna love you and leave you and never return to this place. <laughs> you know what is kind of cool, though? If you're doing like a role play kind of playthrough, like you're a bad smuggler guy, that's really cool. Like, that's a really cool area. Yeah. Uh, but it's it's a no from me. Uh, there's an effigy and there's a chest. Boom. Um, so, yeah, that on the map is here if you're looking for it. If that's something that you've not found yet. Is there another effigy then? No, another box though. Alright, some dudes. Some power sphere. Purple box. Some coins. Oh, whoa. Look at this nice open area though. You know what? I don't want to fight you guys. Just saying. I don't really have many arrows left. Oh, I've got to go this way and there's a waypoint. There's a camp down there. There's a box. Let's grab this. There's some more lore. Today is the law day. Yo, look at that, though. Day 10. What did we pick up a minute ago? 18? Oh, 11. Oh, this is just before... Oh, no, yeah, we did pick up 11. All right, this is day 10. Um, all right, day 10. Today I decided to take my pals on a bit of an excursion. A tower-like object visible in the distance has piqued my curiosity. After walking a while, I encountered another human... When I tried to talk to them, however, they didn't say a word and just pointed a gun at me. Since they're on this island, it would make sense for them to consider them... That sentence was bad. Since they're on this island, it would make sense to consider them a remnant of the ancient civilization. But their attire suggests they're likely from the same era as I am. Are they just like me from the outside? Or has this ancient civilization developed here on its own accord? I was in a rough spot, but my sheep pal protected me, allowing me to escape unscathed. I immediately returned to my base of operations and found that all my pals were safe. There's still so much I have to learn about this island. So do, <laughs> do try to talk to the, the raiders and just had a gun point straight to his face. Let's camp down there. Not dealing with you right now, Wolf. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yo, look at these guys. They're like send. Centaurs? Yeah. Look like some centaurs. I'm going to guess maybe legendaries. Uh, hi, Cinemoth. Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Water boss level 17. I'm going to guess that's an overworld one. All right. Oh, what was that? Well, give me that. Handgun ammo. Hell yeah, boys. Uh, all right. So there's a water boss we need to fight. Oh, God, there's the stupid free alliance. Uh, oh, there's a thing in my doodle over there. Oh. Hey, shiny. Shiny floppy. Okay. Okay. Oh, I don't know if I have enough stuff for this. Let's kill you and hopefully your friend aggro's in a minute. Bro, look at us getting all the lucky stuff. Oh, my God. All right, stop, 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 stop. Get off. Let's get maybe catch us out to help me here. All right. Level 22. I just need to do some damage for me, please, catch us. Uh, it's a grass type. Maybe our socks is best to bring out. Do they always have a flower on their face? I don't remember seeing the flower on them all the time. On fire. Headshots. I don't think they have flowers on. Oh, my God. No way is this dude following me all the way down here. I am busy trying to catch stuff, sir. There's no way. There's no way this dude's coming all the way down it. Right, you return. Oh, my God. Sir, please don't. I'm kind of busy here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right. I think I've got one more good shot on you. Maybe one more shot. God damn. That move did not like that. Okay, Let's see what we've got here. Yes, come on. Oh, damn it. Tiefen, can you... No, oh, no, because I don't want you to attack him. Let's just see if I can catch him. Just got to keep rolling. 
God damn. I don't know why fighting and catching this game is so... Uh, I don't know what the word is. Satisfying? This feels good. The dodging, the rolling, the shooting. I've got many of these left. Oh my god, the more of them are coming. Bro. I'm busy. It's shooting me from a distance. Oh my god. No way. Can you guys stop? Alright. We got it. Hell yeah, boys. Oh. I level up as well. Right. I need to have a quick look because I swear... I know you do have a flower on your head. I guess it's just because it's so big that we saw it then. Like, acknowledged it more. Holy crap. Yeah. All right. Tiefen, I need you to shower me with heal vibes, please. I've only got 12 arrows left now. God damn. Is that, is that it? Is that all the healing we get? All right. Fair enough. Oh, man. Okay. Um, Six. So let's go up and around there. Let's go and get that little check mark. Damn, was that, that was our last, like, good... Oh, my God. No. Not taking you guys on right now. Oh, I see an effigy. Do need to get... I think I need five more to get my next level. I've got to make sure we're collecting them. Uh, where is that? Like, up there? An ancient ritual site. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm, like, stuck down here now. They're still following me. God damn. Um... Wolf, can you jump a little higher? Okay, that's cool. I'll, I'll just climb up myself. Are they still following? I don't think so. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Birds after us. I don't have ammo to fight you. I don't know if I could take you on down here. Probably not. Oh, my Jesus Christ. Now let's get this effigy and just leave. Oh, law. Uh, okay, uh, let's grab some of this. Oh, Lily Everhart's diary. Oh, I've also got a, a thing here. Sick. All right, I'll have a look at that in a minute. Let me just get away from this bird. Jeez. Okay. <laughs> this is definitely the area we're meant to be in for our next, like... I don't know, kind of leveling up and getting shit done for sure. But there's just so much going on. All right. Cool. So, a 28 pe Petalia. Uh, we can actually head up and around here. There's a raider's camp. Uh, we did get another journal from someone else. Lily Everhart, Diary Free. Oh, okay. Uh, let's have a look. Won't you join the Free Power Alliance? Oh, I'm going to guess we learn about them now. The Free Power Alliance is a long-standing organization that works to protect pals. We have lived together with pals since antiquity, and each of us has a deep love for the wondrous creatures. We have five pr traditional commandments. Thou must not eat pals. Thou must not overwork pals. Thou must not abuse pals. Thou must not use pals for experiments. Thou must risk thou life to protect pals. Wouldn't you like to join us and protect the pals you love? Your life in service of protecting pals is a small price to pay. The flesh and blood of humans exists only for the glory of pals. Okay, so there's some weird ass cult. I mean, some of them rules, like don't abuse them and stuff. I stand by that eating them we, we all get a bit hungry and you know as long as we're not over hunting them then that's fine <laughs> but giving our life up for them i don't know bro i don't know if that's me uh right, there's an effigy down there what are we saying god they're everywhere free power people they're literally everywhere there's some right here okay i think what we need to do is no freaking way. Is that another floppy? It is. Oh, I don't have the stuff for it. There's an effigy. Um, crap. <laughs> like, I think we should kill it. Um, okay, let's get off here. I always press E to dismount. I don't... Because I'm going to have to fight two. I don't have... You know what? This is going to be so stupid. And some of you are going to hate me. But I'm going to leave it. I'm going to... I'm just going to leave it. Uh, oh, okay. This is the end of the road. 
What's down there? Well, there's the big tree in the distance. Have we been over there? We have not. Do we reckon we could get over there? Is there any, like, teleports? I don't know if that's going to be a hot or cold place. I believe the orange are teleport places. Um, there's one all over there. Let me get up and around there. It's going to be very dark as well. Um, okay. I mean, like, we don't have a swim thing on us. Uh, what do I want to level up? You know, I'm going to do a tiny bit of weight. I don't know why it's like weight. Uh, in terms of technology, what have we unlocked here? Stun button. Oh, Dazzy's necklace. Oh, I'm not going to touch any of that just yet. You know what? YOLO, right? I just hope that you can make it all the way over there. Stam going down it is. Does it go up? It does not. I guess what we can do is get as far as we can. Pop you in a Pokeball. Oh, well, there's a merchant. Oh, no, we've made it. Oh, he's there. We need water creatures. Twilight Dunes. Okay. Hello. Uh, okay, let's get off you. Pop you away for a minute. Wondering Merchant. How's it going? Buy. Got any cool stuff to buy? Uh, milk. Mind control meds. Mind control meds are extremely effective in controlling dis... dis huh. I don't know what that means. Alright. Cool beans. Uh, oh. Oh, it's cold without my... No freaking way. We found where stupid Lavender lives. All right, we need to get out of here. <laughs> uh, I can put my cold resistant on, right? Yeah, we should be warm. All right, syndicate dudes. Uh, okay, so they've got a little base there. Oh, there's do uh, do mud. So is this a desert? I guess so. Uh, oh, there's a little hang you. There's some little dudes. Okay. I'm going to get... Actually, you know what? I'm going to get out of it. I feel like we're about to get very hot. Oh, God. Oh, they're after us now. Uh, I don't have stuff to protect myself with. <gasps> Look at this guy. Oh, he... Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's hot. Is it hot now? Uh, let's put back armor on. Um... I need this guy. He's he's the dude you want to use for ore. Mm, maybe I need to go back. Right, so <laughs> so dark. Uh, we could swim that, climb up there, and get home. Right? Don't think we're quite ready for that. They're all level. I know, maybe we are. Okay, you know what? We definitely need to explore that. We need to make some heat armor. Uh, should we have to get up there? Okay. Die wolf, die how, you're now a swimmer. Nice. Okay, so. Definitely need to. I wonder if all this connects to this bit. Okay, so the bosses we saw level 45s, 28s. That's 17. A little bit spicy. There's also an egg here. Alright. Oh, you know what? We never hatched the egg at our old base. I think we should do that to end the episode. Alright, boom, egg. Alright, let's get home. Nice. Uh, all right, let's go old home first. Let's have a look at this egg. Ah, old home. It's going to be so, like, bare and look, nothing's happening. <laughs> That's the one thing I need to uh, move to the, the new base is the egg. Hatcher, thingy -ma Uh For now, though, I mean, give me some of this. Uh, put some eggs in here. All right, so this is a large common egg. And... Hey, you got a green tail. Nice. Uh, I guess we're just going to pop that into you there like so. Nice. All right. Let's get to proper base. Ah, see, this just feels so much more homely with all the buildings and the stables and stuff. I like this, man. All right. Perfect. Well, so we found a dungeon. We got that Tomcat, Tombat thing. We got a bit of lore. We actually found a lot of lore today. Found a little um, weird man living down here. Killed the boss, explored. So I think this is what I want to explore next. Uh, we need to make a heat armor. We've got the cold resistance. We don't have a heat resistance one. Uh, what workbench would that be? 
Oh, do I not have that unlocked yet? Oh, there we go. Heat resistance. Flame organs. We can make that right now. It'll be all ready for the next episode. And we can also make a bunch of them for catching stuff in the desert. So what we can do is I think we'll head to the desert, try and find that um, giant turtle dude. Because he's what we want to do when we set up our little iron base. So maybe that's something we can do next episode. But there we are then. So we're going to wrap it up. Call it a day there. Nice little adventure. Lots of bits of lore and stuff. Uh, remember, thou shall not eat pals, right? Definitely wouldn't cook them up and eat them. Yeah, of course we wouldn't. Well, anyways, if you did enjoy today, make sure you are whacking a like. Make sure you are subscribing. You ring the bell. Never notifications. Thank you very much for hanging out. I'll catch you all in a bit. See you later.